guys, Katie is here. In this editing tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to create a double exposure photo with Photoshop. At first, select the photos you would like to make this photo manipulation and drag them into Photoshop. Choose a full growth shot as your base photo and portrait as your secondary photo. Now let's quickly adjust our photo for Instagram post dimensions. For this, I use a crop tool in the Photoshop and dimensions 4 to 5. And let's drag our portrait shot over the full growth shot. For this, be sure to get rid of the lock icon near the layer. For my comfort, I rename the layers to keep everything organized. And to find the best place for the portrait photo in the future photo, I decrease the opacity of the layer. Using the combination of Command T or Control T on keyboard, I can drag and place the photo wherever I want. Then I come back opacity of the layer and change the blend mode from normal to dark or any other blend mode that suits better for my situation. Then I apply mask on the layer and with gradient tool and specific type of gradient you can see on the screen right now, I start to erase the new photo. Of course, I choose classic gradient because it's more familiar to me and more comfortable to use. Then I just click and drag the mouse to erase some parts of the photo. Sometimes I change the opacity of the layer from 100 to lower to make the photo look more smooth. And very cool tip for you to remove this little icon between the main layer and mask that will give you freedom to move and place the portrait photo wherever you want on the future image with keeping the frames of the created mask. Our last step is export photo by using export as and here I keep the high quality and adjust dimensions for the future photo for Instagram post to avoid any Instagram compression. Click export and that's it, our double exposure photo manipulation is ready.